Moshi Moshi my gamers and welcome back to Genshi Impact. These duels are once in a century, each table is a storm of stuff, activities and all the grudges will be settled on this day. Quick question, how the fuck did we get here? about the two inventors of this game every time we see the posters. You're not the only one. There's so little information to go off of that there's all sorts of wild speculations about them. Some people say that they invented the game after the God of Wisdom gave them an epiphany, while others say that they're not actually the inventors at all. By the way, have you two ever read a book called King of Invocations? Uh, I only heard of it. Well, it's a story about a young boy who gets possessed by the spirit of the Crocodile King and becomes a TCG player. It's quite fascinating. I made sure to read it before coming on this trip. Some people have even speculated that the author of the King of Invocations is the boy who was possessed, while the true inventors of the game are the Crocodile King and Ibis King from the Legends. Each of these theories gets more ridiculous than the last. Exactly! Which is why the original author came forward to deny these rumors. But that only fueled the debate further, and the book's sales skyrocketed. Oh it can't God, be denied man. that the King of Invocations novels are a major part of why Genius Invocation genius TCG has AMK. become so popular. Yeah. Just look at the venue. They're almost treating this like a national festival. Yeah, I bet I the book is going to sell novel. more copies after this. <laughs> you can be sure that the Fox Lady is behind all this. Yay, Miko? Fox Lady? Yeah, Yai Miko! She's chief editor of the Yai Publishing House! Paimon can just imagine her eating some fried tofu as she instructs her editors to use this event to boost light novel sales! Oh yes, I've been in that situation many times myself. Although in our case, the boss would be drinking coffee and talking about newspaper sales. Sounds like bosses are the same everywhere. Hmm, did she see that, Paimon? Now, Woundly, calls out the uh, Japan's Beyond, so however you say that, how far? It's not too far away. Go get closer. And I'm curious, so who is here right now? I hope it's a game, Miko. The scenery in every nation is so different. This trip is really paying dividends. Good thing that you're able to be so optimistic about it. It sounded like you were pretty much forced Dude, to come on this trip whether you wanted to or not. Uh, so huh? I want to nap. Wait. Is that who Paimon thinks it is? <gasps> it's Abe! Well, he's a Traveler, Paimon, we meet again. Oh? Who is this? Ah, allow Paimon to introduce you. <sighs> Seems like that's all Paimon's been doing these past few days. <laughs> anyway, this is Charlotte. Is she's she a journalist from Fontaine. This and this is A. She's, uh... She's Inazuma's Archon. What? Y you, you mean, Her Excellency, the almighty Narukami Ogosho, God of Thunder? Huh. <laughs> Hello. Please forgive me for not recognizing you. I... <laughs> As a guest from afar. There's no need to be so formal. Uh, right, uh, like I mean, okay. Oh, each of your acquaintances is more impressive than the last. Miko invited me here to experience the fun and festivities, along with everybody else. Oh, Paimon gets it. The tournament venue is full of excitement and tasty food. And Miko didn't want you to miss out. I guess I'll let you catch up for now. We can meet up later, just like last time. Sure thing. See you, Charlotte. See you, Charlotte. Perhaps she felt a little intimidated by me. Ah, uh, she's probably fine. Don't worry, she didn't leave because of you. We split up like this in previous places we visited too. So, how do you like Genius Invocation TCG? I'm on bets you're enjoying watching the tournament matches. Well, in fact, I myself These am competing in the are tournament. So dog shit. Wait, really? What? Is that surprising. Playing cards is an ancient form of entertainment. And I was curious to see what card games are like in this day and age. How's the tournament been? I advanced all the way to the semi-finals. The semi-finals? That's amazing! So when's your next match? Unfortunately, the semi-finals is where my journey ended. 
The reason being You lost the reason being that she lost to me. Oh and when I say lost, that doesn't begin to do it justice. It was quite a humiliating defeat. Mommy didn't see that coming. <laughs> I'll pretend I didn't hear that. I only lost because I was duped by her little tricks. Oh, so this is just saying sexual doing the match? What's wrong with my little tricks? Trickery within the scope of the rules is better known as ingenuity. It's not my fault that some people spend all their time cooped up in Tenshukaku and never have the chance to hone their skills. What a unique French! Lesbians! Huh. <laughs> You're right, though. I should make an effort to get out more. Many things have changed now that Inazuma is at peace. However, it seems that some people continue to fear the divine light, just as before. In some of my tournament matches, I could see my opponent's hands shaking, hesitant to play their cards. Now that I think about it, perhaps they were scared of what would happen if they defeated me. Oh, eh. Oh, dear, dear. Other players lose their games and throw a tantrum. You win yours, and yet you still find a reason to mope about it. I invited you out for some simple fun and games. Oh, I should have known you'd be like this. Anyway, you should watch and learn, because I plan on using some more of my little tricks to defeat that divine priestess from Watatsumi Island. Oh, so Kokomi's your opponent in the finals? What? Mm-hmm. On one side will be your erstwhile comrade in arms, the leader of Watatsumi Island, and on the other will be head shrine maiden Yai Miko, the wise and beautiful. So, little one, who will you support? Oh shit, we get the pick who's? I was kinda hoping it was like, oh, I'm gonna guess Goru, just tease ass. So, so could be a Kokomi or Yai Miko, uh, uh, why is he, uh, I know I'm picking, mommy all the way. Good choice. Miko, come on. No need to put them on the spot like that. <laughs> I know. I just wanted to see how they'd react. Oh, the venue is right over there. Why not go and take a walk around? Oh, and if you meet my fellow finalist, do pass on my regards. Oh, goals though too. I mean, they better be... Okay, hold up. Are they... I think that... Wait a minute, why the hell so... It's like she's touching her thigh! <laughs> Oh my god, it's like, what? Yeah, I am touching my thigh on my ass, you not tell? I like that feeling. This is how it feels to touch some lesbian thighs. Oh, oh you, you're gonna make me feel so weird. Okay, anyways, we're gonna go up here. Hello? My fellow fo- <gasps> Ew! Hey! Hey, compadre. And flying watermelon. <laughs> oh, bull checker! Uh, funny! <laughs> Did you still compete in the tournament? <laughs> what would this tournament be without Arataki, the oh, ultimate yeah, TCG so champion, Ito? Matter of fact, the whole Arataki gang showed up in force. Our goal? To bring home the grand prize. <sighs> As fate would have it, Boss was the only one who didn't make it out of the qualifiers. What? Hey! That's not the point! It was just some bad luck, that's all. I got matched against a strong opponent in the first round. Besides, it was a close match. It could have swung either way. I wouldn't exactly call losing in three rounds a close match. Hey, Shinobu, cut me some slack in front of my friends, okay? Anyway, it's not like you did much better. Weren't you beaten by that fish lady? Uh, Sandy, Mama Mia, whatever her name was. <laughs> it's Kokomi, my friend. <sighs> Sangonomiya Kokomi? Yes. Watatsumi Island's military strategist? Yes, she beat me fair and square. I don't have a problem with that. <sighs> well, anyway, I've noticed something in this competition. If you want to win big here, you need style. That's right, I'm talking card backs. I lost my match because my backs were whack. But the style what? of card backs and a player's skill don't have anything to do with each other. Oh, no, 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 no. That's where you're wrong, Mini Milan. It's just like how the strongest Oni Kabuto have the brightest colors on their back. If your cards look cool, then you'll definitely draw a better hand. Ah, uh, speedle fighting and playing TCGs are completely different. In cards, you actually have to rely on your own skill. Uh-huh. Yeah, there's no use arguing with you. Why don't we let our friend here weigh in, hmm? Hmm, let's see. Uh, let's see. Why don't we play a match and see? Actually, I think it has a point. Actually, no! I think, I think Shinobu has a point. See? 
he agrees. You know why? All right, that's it. I know how to settle this. We're gonna play a match Go right Joe. now. You and me. How about this, Shinobu? Lend me your deck. You've got some pretty slick card backs. Hmm. The traveler probably has cool card backs too. Maybe even better than yours. Okay, in that case, you can use my deck. Boss, how do I put this? Nobody could win with that deck of yours. No matter who uses it. Hey, quit busting my chops! Sheesh! What do you say, Traveler? You got time for a match now? Uh... Oh, you know what? Yeah, sure! I accept your challenge, idiot! Great! See? This is what I call a true compadre! <laughs> <sighs> All right, I'll be the judge then. Just remember to take it easy, you two. This isn't a high-stakes match. It really doesn't matter who wins or loses. Oh, sh 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 oh, do you guys hear that? Oh, it's the cry of my cards, cheering me on in the wind. <laughs> my cards, you mean? Attack me now, bro. Yeah, surely. Let's see. So, Stray's induction to prove us recently, I attacked the ultimate teacher chap in Eat to invite you to the duel. We both call his back effect the outcome of the battle. Especially will you like your deck to and Jace into a duel. Let's, I'm just gonna leave. L. Those L are his! And L. He got you, Miko? What? He got you, Miko? What? I wanted that! I don't have one! No, whatever. I'm just gonna. No, I'm gonna keep these cards. They look fine. We're gonna make this the most exhilarating TCG duel ever, compadre. What well, nickname? Either side will have a good time dealing with boss's deck. You got your Wait, so oh wait, that's Chernobyl's cards. She got your Mikko cards. <laughs> wow, you better love her. I don't have her. <laughs> Idiot, you go first. You, yeah, heal. Step aside. Ito's back in town. Oh, you get Kali first. Okay. Let's see how it goes. Let's see how this dries up. I forgot who's who's. Oh, wait. I don't have any of the. Okay, I remember. Okay. Good start. Oh, be some ass. What? Less and this has one. Let my card out. Can I use one of these? No, nope, I can't. Okay, that's which I'm gonna use. So I'm gonna say the strike at colleague. She really is trying to kill me. Um. Are you gonna take my kill? Can I just use this? Let's roll. Just make it even. Oh, you switch to. Okay. I see how it is. Um. I do gotta switch care of this, so I'll say since that's gonna water. How about I use ice? Switch to ice. Time for some training? You good? Healing. Oh hell no. I'm done. That's over. That's fine. Ooh. Thanks. Okay, Geo, Ice, Electro, let me remember. Geo, Ice, and Electro. Okay. You still go away. Ooh, mostly razors. Oh, <gasps> Give us you. A touch of frost. Okay. Oh, that took one card away from mine. Okay. What? What do you mean? I tried a curse strike. Oh shit! I supposed to be a little. Yeah, I don't got a choice though. I don't got a choice. I gotta do this for now. 
Okay. Attack. There you go. Right here. Okay. And my turn. You switch the calling? Go! Um. Now we gotta do both. Okay, good. Oh! Still got water on me! Ouch! Okay, maybe it's- Okay, yeah, I gotta heal, I gotta heal! This is not good. Okay, we don't have any of these, so get out of here. Heal. Eat. Eat. Follow. Wait. They don't heal. Follow. Follow. What is this one? Oh come on! Really? You you kidding me? Eating my ass, right? I don't get the Ito. Hmm. Only Claymore Kelters. Well, that's chunkin for you if you ask me. Wait, they're all Claymore Kelters. You take this. Uh, okay, um... Everything else, I'm gonna need to... There you go. Hmm... Okay, now this one needs to... Oh, someone's getting iced to death! You're gonna die. It's not good. Oh shit! But my thing is over. Eh. Out of my town. I can't even switch. And they have. I'm gone. Oh! Don't discourage your evil. Like, before, didn't do that, so. You don't. Now you see what the champ is capable of! <clears throat> you have my deck to thank for that. Yeah, you fight! Yo! Can you chill? Thank you. Oh, come on! See you at the rematch. Um, pretty much dead, so. I'll scout ahead. Wait, is it? Oh, wow, you guys are cheating. Titus. Not really though, this is a fail game. Okay. It's just Razor. He's the only one, my main, that's still alive. Yeah, this is the switch. I need mostly these. Oh my god, this is that good. Three, three. Does it really matter? This is not good. Just kill me already. I'm gonna die anyways. Oh, I could do that. Oh. Yeah, you killed me. Was I using meant to lose or I mean, sure was it we don't have to lose or win. It wouldn't matter. Why did you have to not dive into me after that? What's the point? See? My theory was What's the point? Don't let it get to you. You were using boss's deck after all. Oh, I'm sad. Anyway, what are you two doing here? Actually, we were looking for Kokomi. Have you seen her? As Arataki numero uno idioso so eloquently called her, 
The fish lady. <laughs> you want to talk? No, no. Melon. Her match in the finals will be starting shortly, so she can't be far. Why don't you ask Kujo Sara over there? The Tenryo Commission is in charge of managing access glass. to the venue and maintaining order. Hey, just remember that if you ever want to play another match, you can find me anytime. Choi. Oh, you beat my ass. Okay, I thought just over here. I guess she moved over for a second. Hey, Kojo Sara, what you doing over here? Hi, Sara. We're looking for Kokomi. Have you seen her anywhere? I saw her exit the venue after the semifinals, but she hasn't returned since. If you're looking for her excellency, I believe she's currently near the western shore of Rito. Go! Goro! Good to see you! Hello, you two. Is there something the matter? No, we just wanted to say hello to Kokomi. Hmm. Now that I think about it, her opponent in the finals will be a tough one to beat. Who are you rooting for, Sara? Up till now, the almighty Shogun had my full support. But now that she's been eliminated from the tournament, in truth, I don't really care. I don't thought for sure you'd be rooting for Miko. I certainly would, in the past. But now that the islands of Narukami and Watatsumi are on amiable terms, we're all friends. Those are exactly Her Excellency's thoughts as well. The point of a game of cards between friends is to exchange skills and enjoy the game together. It's not about who wins or loses. She hopes that this spirit of friendly competition will define Inazuma going forward. <laughs> A commendable attitude. Her opponent is skilled in the art of deception. Even if she appears to have worry written all over her face, don't fall for it. She's likely trying to lead you into a trap. It's nice to see two generals who were once enemies on the battlefield now looking out for each other. Do not be mistaken. I speak only in the interest of fairness. The moment I saw the name Sangonomiya on the list of competitors, I anticipated that she would make it into the finals to face the almighty Shogun. I've watched every one of her matches. She constantly adapts her strategy and excels at employing rare and unusual tactics. But after the almighty Shogun's loss, I'm afraid that Lady Guji may also have caught wind of Kokomi's strategies. Oh, so you want to make sure Kokomi's got intel on the other side too? Wow, trust Sora to make sure everything is fair and above board. Hmm. Thanks for your insights, General Kujo. I will be sure to pass them along to Her Excellency. Don't mention it. The match will be starting shortly. Please, let her know to get back to the venue soon. All right, then I'll get going. Okay. Now, she's not that far away. I'm just gonna cl- You can't climb! Okay, never mind. I'll take it back. Guess we'll go this way. Ugh. Okay, let's go up. Are those two? They're not heal. Never mind, not heal. Okay, don't waste my stamina. I'm just gonna go this way. Let's go, Kobe. I'm gonna go now. My lady! We're gonna go! We're gonna go! Turning for other reasons too. Yes, I thought you might understand. Huh? 
What are you talking about? Who wins and who loses isn't what's most important. What's important is that Her Excellency came here to compete with all of Inazuma watching. Yes, more people will be traveling between Watatsumi and Narukami Island from this day forward. The point I hope to make is, even though we believe in different gods, we can all come together as friends by playing cards at the table. We should be willing to cooperate and assist one another in the future. You could say that I'm playing cards to help dissolve enmity. You're using a simple game of cards to drive major social change. Yes, that's a good way to put it. Besides, my passion has always been in tactics and strategy. Oh, How shit. could I pass up the chance to play in a tournament for a strategic game like this? So you have your personal reasons to play too! <laughs> yes, partly. You should be careful of that fox lady. Even Sara warned us that she'll be a cunning opponent. <sighs> yes. It seems that you're not the only one who sees this tournament as a chance to resolve our differences, Your Excellency. Oh, that's good to hear. Don't worry, Paimon. I've already thought of a variety of stratagems for the match. Wow! Paimon's really looking forward to the final now! And Paimon swears that she's actually gonna see it this time! No matter what! Paimon won't let herself get distracted! Not even by all the tasty snacks in Inazuma! Good luck, Hokomi. Thank you. Alright, let's go. Yes, let's go, my friends. Now, what's time to we do? To return to finals. Yes, we're going to the finals. But lady, if we don't win this match, what's gonna happen? Oh, nothing. We just we just have fun, right? Did we have fun? Yeah. Yeah, it's all about fun, okay? No competition. Just have fun. Inazuma's Archon bolts her way to the semifinals, only to be stunned by a crafty opponent. Can I do this real quick? Ooh, that's a nice title. Lightning from Inazuma won't be able to reach me in Fontaine, right? I'm gonna say some bad boy on? <laughs> I don't think the Electro Archon would get upset over a minor thing like this. Hey, what are you two chatting about? Oh, wait a second. The real question is, how many times are we gonna run into Kirara? Many times. Talk about a coincidence, right? What are the chances? I interviewed a few people around Rito, but no more details on the card snatcher, unfortunately. After that, I ran into Kirara here. We got to chatting, and then I found out that she knew you too. Sorry, you said the card snatcher? Oh, let Paimon explain. Paimon tells Kokomi everything that happened recently. Mm hmm. I think I already have some insights regarding Ow. the truth of this matter. Really? That bad? But it's a little complicated, and the finals are about to start. Let me put it this way, though. The key to this case <laughs> is away. actually Kirara. Oh shit, he's chasing huh? me. Oh, oh shit, wait, he's chasing what? me. What? Oh shit. How could I be? Wait, oh, shit. what? I haven't chatted with Kirara. I was starting to think the same thing. Sorry, I don't have time to explain now. We'll have to continue after the tournament's finished. Just focus on your match, Kokomi. Uh, no, walk up with me. What should we do? Bad idea. Paimon's it's still bad idea. trying to wrap her head around that. If Kokomi was only working off of what Paimon told her, how come Paimon can't find the answer? Oh, is Paimon really as dumb as a lavender melon? Hmm, don't worry, Belle. Let's watch the competition. Uh, oh, okay. Welcome to the final of the King of Invocations Grand Prix Inazuman Regional Final! Our contestants no, no. are... Guji Yai Miko of the Grand Narukami Shrine versus Sangonomiya Kokomi! Divine... Oh, not on speaking. Ooh, face off. Without further ado... Let Fuck the you. final Should've match begin! Done that. Done that. Yay, it's now, to find out who will play first. Come here, boss! You Come took here. your time. You're the one that jumped me. You're the one that I'm jumped starting me. to wonder if you got lost that walking me. on the seabed, hey, Miss Soul like of the Deep. You must hey, be tired hey, after hey, the walk hey, back hey. to shore. Perhaps I should let you go first. Yeah, there's no yeah. need. Ooh. I've heard that fried tofu with all the frills gets yeah. cold quickly. So if we don't serve it right away, then I'm afraid it'll become a cold, greasy mess. Round one. 
You two, the two play close into the game of genius justification. Who? Who? I feel bad. Come on, see it. Sangonomiya Kokomi, oh, the divine priestess from Watatsumi Island. And I won't get hold of it anyways because I love them both. It was a brilliant victory. Thank you. Company! That was a real nail biter, but you did it! That Miko is a crafty one. <laughs> Pretending she had no strategy and letting one of her own character cards get defeated? Then she played two cards from her hand that required to apply a character card. She <gasps> came pretty close to turning the match around. Oh, she just appeared like a ghost. Goodness, what's all the commotion over here? Discussing something interesting behind my back? I... <laughs> It's no pity at all. It was just a little fun competition. It was Papa so shush. We'll see who wins next time. What do you say, Miss Soul of the Deep? How about a rematch? What? This fried tofu with all the flies has not gotten too cold. I would be happy to play. However, the traveler here is waiting for me to help them solve a puzzle they've been facing. Oh really? Then I won't disturb you. Can can you Miko help too? I'll go play with Goro instead. <laughs> it's been a while since I've seen those fuzzy ears of his. His tail sticking out! <laughs> <laughs> now, back to our conversation. Kirara, you've been delivering items between different nations for the past several days, correct? <laughs> That's right. I've had quite a few deliveries recently. But what does that have to do with the card snatcher? The strange thing is that Kirara's delivery route has coincided with the card snatcher's movements at every turn. Yes. And therein lies the clue. You mean, Kirara is the card snatcher? Huh? Hey, that's not true. I'm just out here doing my job. You can't just throw false accusations at a person. Uh, I mean, a yokai like this. Calm down, you two. Kirara's not the thief. Oh, good. Oh, hey, Kirara. Have any of your packages in the past few days been from the same sender? Or were any sent to the same destination? Let me think. Senders have all been different. But there's one destination that keeps coming up in every region I've been to. Really? And what destination is that? Um, I'm not at liberty to give you the exact address. Whoa. But I can tell you that it's in Sumeru. Where are the contents light? No larger than the size of an envelope? Huh? Wait, you're not one of those yokai who has prophetic dreams, are you? I used to hear stories about that when I was curled up on my grandma's lap. <laughs> I'm only the divine priestess of what is in the island. I just like to read novel? light novels and books about military strategy. Divination's not my field. Hmm. So... Well, after all I've said so far, have you arrived really at the same answer as me? Hmm, let me think. Oh yeah, okay, thinking time! Oh, right. Impulse. Every nation Kirara visited had a parcel sent to Sumeru. Hmm, <laughs> yeah, eat this boy, speak more. The contents were light and were no larger than an envelope. Mm-hmm. You know, it's nice to hear eat this voice. The contents were probably genius invocation cards. Hmm, I think so. Kirara's actions. Well, we went into Kirara well. multiple times throughout our trip. That's why I backed up. Yes, the car is Nash's actions. We came to Inazuma because we tracked a thief here. Uh, can you associate this with that? Hmm. There doesn't. Nope. Okay. Hmm. Nope. Hmm. This one. Hmm. Hmm. How about trigger? Hmm. No. Cancel. Okay. How about I? S no. No. Really? Submit. This one! No. Oh my god. No. I don't know what? No. Okay. Let's try. What about this one? Hmm. Oh wait, 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 maybe I got maybe I got it. Let me cancel this. Um So I can I use one of these two? 
Okay, I guess if it's this one and the package Livy. Hmm. I guess not. Hold up, it was not that one. Hmm. How is it not? Hmm. So it's none of these. Okay, associate. I guess that's the one. The thief is using Kokomi's Express. Yeah! No. The thief is likely using Komania Express to send packages. Okay, if that's the case, um. Associate. The truth. Behind? There you go. That took a while. Yes! You nailed it. So the cardbacks we've been looking for have been right under our noses all along? But there's still one thing that doesn't quite add up. Kirara picked up her package in Mondstadt before we encountered the card snatcher. The timing doesn't make sense. I've thought about that too. The way I see it, there's more than just one thief involved. So, will trailing not one but multiple card snatchers? Yes. The person you've been tracking most likely is one member of the group. It seems the other members had already obtained the card backs and sent them together. Hmm. Now that I think about it, collecting all those card backs across so many nations would be near impossible for just one person. But why is it the one we're following ever using Komania Express? Because he's too slow. He probably missed the arranged shipment date. Well, that's how I figure it at least. From your explanation, He's only committed theft on one occasion, and there were even witnesses. After that, he's been trading or playing to collect the card backs. I suspect that this person isn't a very good thief. He probably used the mora he was given to arrange shipments with Komania Express as funds to use for trading. And there's another question now. Why don't the other members just keep the cards and take them back to Sumeru themselves? Unless there's a reason for them to stay. Yes. This is a question I'm still grappling with now. What is the thief's objective? What kind of secret is hidden behind these card backs? Unfortunately, there's no way Dude, to I'm know without one seeing one for ourselves. Uh, uh, hey! Don't look at me like that! I can't just open a customer's parcel! If the company ever found out, I'd be fired on the spot! And I don't want to go back to being a yokai in the mountains of Inazuma! No, we don't want to cause you any trouble, of course. At this That's point... Um, maybe it would be best for you all to accompany Kiara to see what? Good idea! Going to the delivery what? location is the only lead worth following now! And if the recipient really is a bad guy, then Kiara could be in danger! We should come along to make sure you're safe! I can beat the shit out of them! Hey, I know my way around the fight too! I haven't had a single package stolen from me since I've started this job! Whenever someone picks on me thinking I'd be an easy target to take packages from, I send them running. We have to get to the bottom of this mystery. Uh, let me think about it. Alright, I'll let you come with me to the delivery point in Sumeru, but on one condition. Yeah? You have to promise that you'll hide somewhere where the customer can't see you. Who's ever heard of a group of people delivering packages? No problem, you got it! Also, even if the customer is a bad guy and has stolen things, we should leave that for the local authorities to handle. Absolutely. Oh, we're really oh, traveling going. all over the place this time. Good luck. You'll have to tell me how everything turns out the next time we meet. Yes, Kokomi. I'll hug you goodbye. See you later. And I'll put checks out before I go. Okay, before I go, um... So, they'll... Down, I believe you go down this way. She gave Miko real quick, right? Where is Yemiko? If she's not here, I'm done. I am completely done. I'll see you here, no mind! Alright guys, I'm gonna bail. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you later, so you know.